Nitanam guys, welcome back to another episode. I welcome you all with my love and respects and the blessings of my Guru, His Divine Holiness, Bhagwan Shri Nityananda Paramashivam. Today's episode is about a powerful cognition about how the importance of Guru in the way that Swamiji, because he is an avatar of Paramashiva, he is aware, he has access to everything. He has access to the past lives, to what's happening now and what is written in the future. And that is very uh, important for him to guide us properly. Only a being which is established in that space, pure space of Paramashivoham, Paramashivatwa, an avatar, only such a being can truly guide his disciples towards the ultimate. It is important that your master, your guru, knows about everything from the past. Only then he can guide you accordingly now so that the completion happens to you and that you can manifest the space of Paramashivam. You can get into that, uh, radiate the state, space, powers and being of Paramashiva. So, um, Guru is actually a very big commitment. Swamiji was giving a differentiation between teacher, acharya and guru. A teacher is just somebody who shares knowledge. An acharya is somebody who shares knowledge and lives the knowledge he shares. And the guru is not only he shares knowledge, lives the knowledge he shares, but he takes the responsibility entirely of the being in front of him. So when you surrender to Swamiji, he is not he's going to take care of your entire life from the Akashic records, from all the past lives and everything that you carry in your bio memory, muscle memory, he will take the responsibility to, um, to train you in the way that uh, the surrender happens totally in you so that you can put everything at his feet and you can, he can shower himself onto us. The space of Paramashiva can be simply bestowed through initiation and blessing. So that is why um, that is why connecting with Swamiji, having a strong feeling connection is very important because he's the only one who can truly guide you um, where you need to go so that you can experience the, the conscious breakthrough. You are uh, consciously or unconsciously, or I should say knowingly or unknowingly, looking for so that you can experience life in the most blissful way. So that's a very important factor. Why the Guru-Disciple relationship? Because only the right Guru can guide you towards where you want to go. So with this, I'll end up for this episode. I'll see you guys soon. Nityanandam.